slight change of setup for this video. Uh, I know I move it around literally every single video, but I've never had my beautiful wallpaper behind me. I haven't checked. I'm pretty sure I haven't done the TMI tag. And not that I've run out of video ideas or anything. I'm just far too lazy to film the really good ones because they take a lot of work, a lot of moving the tripod and refocusing, stuff like that. I haven't got the effort. I just want to sit down and talk. Therefore, here is that. What are you wearing? I'm currently wearing a dress with the squirrels on it. It's from Boohoo. I don't know if it's still on there, but um, I saw it and I was literally like, oh my god, that's perfect for me. Just squirrels. Why not? It's a really nice length, like above the knee, and it's like skater dress style. Ever been in love? No. Ever had a terrible breakup? No. How tall are you? I think I'm 5'2". I might be 5'2 and a half though, like so pushing 5'3", but uh, I've been 5'2 since I was about 11, which is really bad, and I'm 18 soon. Holy shit, I'm 18 soon. I've just not grown. I don't think I'm going to grow any further than this. How much do you weigh? I honestly don't know. Any tattoos? No. I would like some in the future though, but every time I think of an idea, I'm like, yeah, but then, is that going to be really lame to get? Like, I have one idea for what, but I've said it to one of my friends and they were like, really? So I'm just kind of like, hmm, well, I wanted it. Any piercings? I actually don't have any, and that's so weird. Like, I don't even have my ears pierced. I've never, ever, ever had a piercing. OTP. Destial. No competition about it. Favourite show. I don't know. I have a lot of favourite shows. Supernatural, but then I'm more critical of that. Walking Dead, pretty fantastic. Really into Pretty Little Lies at the moment. Like, oh my god, that show is so good. Favourite bands? Uh, just name a few. Ben and Caladis, Green Day. I like Blink quite a lot. Uh, this is stressful. Actually, bands, can I say singers? I like Ollie Merz. Ollie Merz is cool. Something you miss? I miss reading. I'm in the biggest reading slump at the minute. And I haven't finished a book since... February. Oh my god, that is so scary. And I'm a huge bookworm, so it's really peeing me off because I've got just a, like a beautiful bookshelf over there, just full of books, being like, read me please! Favourite song? This is the most difficult question ever. Because I used to always say uh, Angel with a Shotgun by The Cab, but I haven't actually listened to that song for about a year. I'll possibly say Falling for the First Time by Ben Nicolaitis. How old are you? I am 17, 18 in a month. Zodiac sign. Cancer. Quality you look for in a partner. They have to be funny, but not like, oh, I'm funny, I'm so suave. Oh, I we'll have my glass and I make everyone laugh at the party. Dorky, like just stupid. Kind of like Chris Pratt. Like that, Chris Pratt's whole persona, that's kind of what I'm going for. Favourite quote. This is a quote I got from a book, but the quote in the book is from poet and I don't know who the poet is marry someone I don't know tell me what you want to do with your one wild and precious life favorite actor I might have to say uh Chris Evans he's he's pretty good he's quite versatile I love that favorite color I like red red's pretty cool loud music or soft um loud music maybe soft mu I have playlist which my playlist are split into like is it soft music? Is it loud music? Where do you go when you're sad? I don't know, I just like my bed. My bed is great. It's right here. How long does it take you to shower? Fun fact, our house doesn't have a shower. So I have to have a bath, which obviously takes like half an hour. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Again, I literally could roll out of bed about 10 minutes before I had to leave and I'd be absolutely fine. Ever been in a physical fight? No. Turn on. <gasps> when four, oh my God. Guys with forearms. <laughs> Guys with forearms. Guys with really nice forearms. Not like veiny, like like Russell Howard has nice forearms. Turn off. It's when people say really problematic things, I guess. Like I don't know, if someone's just like, Oh, I hate those feminazis, I'm just like, no no, bye. The reason I joined YouTube, I watched a lot of YouTube because I was a 12 year old and every 12 year old watches YouTube. And I was like, hey, I could do that. I could be famous. I could be like Shane Dawson. What are your fears? My fears are cannibals and frogs. 
last thing that made you cry. I know what it was. I watched the teens react to uh, See You Again, that song from Fast and Furious. It made me cry because the song, every time it comes on, I'm just like, <gasps> which I have no feelings towards Fast and Furious at all. I saw it in the cinema and I didn't cry in the cinema. I was kind of like, but I don't know why. It just, it's really sad to me. And I'm getting goosebumps now because I'm just thinking about it. Last time you said you loved someone. I think I said it to my friend earlier because she gave me 10p. And I said, I love you, mummy. And she was a bit freaked out. I was saying mummy because she was like giving other people money. And it was like, when you're like, mum, can I have some money to get the bus? Meaning behind your YouTube name, I like to talk. And I was just like, hey, what's something edgy and fun and cool? Which I regret so much because people always comment if I, if I'm being argumentative in YouTube comments, because I do that all the time, people will just not take any notice of any opinions I'm expressing. They'll just disagree, but they'll just put, oh, gee, Vicky, shut up. And I'm like, oh my God, 10 out of 10. Well done. Well done, amazing joke. No one's ever made that joke before. You're so good. Oh my god, you should be a comedian. Last book you read? I don't actually know. I'm gonna check my Goodreads. It was Sugar Rush by Julie Burchill, which is a book about a girl who is in love with her best friend. The book you're currently reading. I have a bad habit of starting books and not finishing them. So this is my currently reading pile. I will just go through a couple of the books right here. Bitten by Kelly Armstrong. City of Brains by Cassandra Clare because I haven't read this series yet. It's kind of a funny story. I borrowed this off my friend two years ago. Still haven't read it, still haven't given it back. The novelisation of Star Trek Into Darkness. Pride and Prejudice. Jane Eyre. Game of Thrones, which is the most difficult book to get through ever. Look at this. I have a chapter left to read, but I just haven't, and I don't know why. One Day by David Nichols. And lastly, Star to Pretend by David Nichols. Last show you watched. I was literally watching Prick Little Liars five minutes before filming this video. The relationship between you and the last person you text. Oh, Holly texted me. And uh, she is a very close friend I have from college. Favourite food. Mexican food. I like enchiladas, but I haven't had them in a while. Place you want to visit. Uh, off the top of my head, uh, the Rabbit Island in Japan. Last place you were. I was at college today, then when we went and got slushies. Do you have a crush? Have you seen this wall i have a lot of crushes they're all celebrity crushes last time you kissed someone i don't know last time you were insulted i don't get insulted very easily so i literally can't remember favorite flavor of sweet i will just go for strawberry because i'm boring what instruments do you play i can kind of play ukulele and i can kind of play piano last sport you played i don't know if this counts swimming i went swimming at the weekend Last song you sang? Probably Beautiful to Me by Lynn Mears because I was making a Destiel gift set about it. Favourite chat up line? I don't know, I wouldn't use chat up lines because I don't think anyone has ever scored by using a chat up line. Have you ever used it? No, because I don't use chat up lines. Last time you hung out with anyone? Um, college, I guess. Who should answer these questions next? Holly, you should. I know you're going to hate doing this and will probably take months to do it, but you know. Yeah, Holly can do it. Ollie can do it as well. Um, I don't have any other YouTuber friends. <gasps> that was the TMI tag. Everyone is probably asleep or stopped watching by now. But if you made it, thanks. And that was my video for this week. I will see you in my next one. Bye. I hate when the email sound goes off when the iPad's just across the room and then I'm just like... Oh great, I can hear it from miles away, just the wow. Also when I get Twitch notifications in the middle of videos, it's really annoying. Just like, oh really, I really care that someone has gone to get coffee. Great. I should end this video now. <laughs> ah! Just in the day and it's really cool because it looks like you dressed up when you didn't because you just couldn't be bothered. To match two pieces of clothing so you put on a dress. Life hack, if you're hungover and you need to be somewhere and look decent, wear a dress because everyone will think, oh she dressed up when you're like, nah -uh, I'm so hungover right now. Oh my god hair, you're so crappy, you look crappy and you are crappy.